Hello everybody, it's Seth here, and we are playing Zombie Evil Kill 4, and, uh, yeah, we, uh, we're gonna start this video right now, we're at the level that we left off from. Gonna need the big guns for this zombie. You ain't nothing, boy. Come on. Ooh, you flies a pancake. Why'd you stop, dude? Motherfracker. Trevor Phillips in the house. And the cra If I was any character from Grand Theft Auto V, I would probably be Trevor, unless Trevor's weak. Man, ain't nobody care about commercials. Let's see what they got for us. So far, it looks empty. It's a big city, though. Like, we're still in a city. This is like a second portion of the third game maybe this is like part two but the third game it's part two of the third game but this is the fourth game if only we had that jump thing we wouldn't have to worry about getting hit by these zombies all the time. Ah, perfect headshot. To perfection. No KFC for you. I love that restaurant. Finger looking good. Alright, uh. Well, here's some zombies we can just kill head on. There's another one just sitting there. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, there's another one of them zombies. Should have seen that coming. Right on there. <laughs> he didn't stand a chance any other way. He's like that. He's the same guy from the second game and the last game, but he stood no chance any uh, any other way. <laughs> Zombie down. <laughs> What's up, amigo? Hit me with your best shot. Or just be a loser and take a shot from me. And these zombies can't do anything. They're helpless. Sit your bad ass down, boy. Alright, these people are safe to come in this part of the city now. I'm like on the... On the FBI, on the FBI side of it all. Come face the might of Seth. Oh, right. I'm in charge here, Freddy. I just got to swim my way to that ladder over there. This goes on for quite some time. <laughs> it actually swam faster if he quit holding the gun, like put it in his like shirt, like in the back of his shirt, and like actually go swimming. We could actually already been here like a few seconds ago. But no, instead here we are. Oh, you came all the way here just to get your, get your head blown off. In the end, it doesn't even matter. Man, you ain't getting nothing.
All right, now he's got all these little guys. I call them little because they ain't really worth. These guys are easy to kill. With the exception of that, with the exception of the third game where it took like so many shots to kill him in the head. Giant ones are actually the ones that are hard to kill though. Because there's giant versions of these guys. Soon the city, soon the city will be safe to walk around in. Man, ain't nobody care about the commercials. This is not what bodybuilders have time for. We we trained hard. We trained hard to be a, a zombie killer. Uh, where are we supposed to go? I just gotta keep walking in this general direction. I might need to use our thing that makes us go walk slow across it. That way we don't fall in dead. Because we'll instantly die if we fall off because we're not supposed to be like out of bounds and that would be out of bounds so we'd instantly die. We will take fall damage, but oh well. I mean, we're already at the exit anyway. I mean, we'll just be back to 200% health anyway after this walkthrough. Making sure there ain't no zombies around. These guys want to pop out in random places. Or you wouldn't even expect anyone to go anyway. Unless you're really curious like I am. Is Among Us really that good? I mean, I've heard of the game, it was like, not, it wasn't bad or anything, but I played better. But that's just me. People have their own opinions. They should make this game, like, they should, like, re, like, do a remake of this game. And instead of zombies, they should put robots in this game. That'd be, like, cool, like, going up against death bots. Like, that are trying to destroy the city and stuff. That, now, that one would be awesome. Games with robots, with, with, with evil robots in it. That would make a game worth playing. I mean, this game is already worth playing, but you know what I mean. Mother fracker.
kill him. Time to snipe this bitch. I've got a license to be a soldier. Not, not really. I'm just, you know, playing along with the game, playing along with this guy I'm playing as. I am a certified, uh, war person I fight for justice man get out that gun He won't be coming back from that. And that's good for us, too. Shoot him. Wait, didn't we just, weren't we just in this area? What are we doing back? I shouldn't even be wasting my time with you, boy. You just a B word.
Flood, go ahead, flood me with them. I'll take them out one by one. You should have been smarter than this, dude. <laughs> you should have turned around. Now look at ya. <laughs> I just made you even dumber. Man, I don't even need to shoot him with this gun. Oh, shoot. <laughs> See, I think what's been happening is the game wanted me to go easier on you, on you crawling zombies. But now I'm going to go hard on you because I got this gun. There we go. Hang in there, phone. I'll have to turn you off whenever I'm done with this. Man, my phone's getting hot. I don't know why my phone keeps getting hot. Every time I play this game, it keeps getting hot. But I freaking love this game. Shit, I didn't even know I had this gun. Right, right, right at that minute, I forgot that I still had this gun. Here we are in the Brit on the bridge of fame. That's what I'd call it. It's kind of a cringy name, but. Took you long enough to notice I was like right there. I think that's all of them. I don't know what happened to that bridge back there, though, but it broke. Like, this bridge broke in half. Did the zombies really do this? 
All right, guys. Uh, I will do the final part of this. Um, you guys have a nice day, and I'll see you next time. Have peace. Thank you for watching. Peace.